Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topic Show Batches. You want the Adequai and the actor and director, her husband, Abiodun Ishola Thomas, are celebrating today not just about the festive season, but also celebrating her husband as he turns a year older. And you want the in celebration of her husband says, Happy birthday to the love of my life, my bestie, my virginity keeper, my lover, my soulmate, my everything. The one who never ceases to amaze me. You are my true love, and I feel blessed to have you at my side. There is nowhere else in the world i did rather be than next to you my partner in life my amazing husband nothing is sweeter than kisses from your honey forget the fact that i did breastfeed you you know say i got you anytime any day anywhere honey thank you for who you are and all that you do i love you so much and i'm so glad you were born on a beautiful christmas day your existence has given us double reasons to celebrate this day every year Ishalami, may God continue to bless the works of your hand. And may you never stumble at your women. Abiodun Ishala Thomas. This lovely couple has also shared lovely photos in celebration of this day. They are one of the Yoruba movie couples we have. This talented Yoruba actress, Iwande Adeko Abiodun, has a reason to be super grateful for today. And the excited actress due to her social media platform to post photos of herself and her husband, the baby boy, as well as praising with sweet words. This couple have two lovely kids together. So happy birthday to Iwande Adeko. Koya Abiodun's husband. So let's talk about Yuwande and her husband. She was supposed to Ibado in Oyo State for NYC program, and that was how they met. She was a club member in 2008, and they got married in 2013. So what was the side attraction? Yuwande thinks it was just God because this is the issue of two different people coming together. Maybe it has been written that it will be like that because both of them didn't even know each other before they started. God did the link miraculously. And the rest is history today. And in appreciation to his wife's message, Abiodun says, Thank you, my beautiful and wonderful queen. May God continue to bless our household. Thanks for loving me so dearly and tenderly. I shall sure love you right back. So how old is Abiodun Shalatamas? He's 40-something. Abiodun says, 40-something years of grace and mercy. Thank you, God, for everything. Was born in a great day. Happy birthday, Ishola. Omodbolaan. So we see one day at the choir at building. You are there, the choir building is a popular Yuba actress, filmmaker, director, and a producer in the Yuba movie industry. And her husband, Abiodun Shola Thomas, is also a popular Yuba actor, director, and a producer. You want the choir building is known for a fierce look when she's behind the camera or in front of the camera. She's from Ogun State and she's the tall child in a family of five. And today they are celebrating her husband's birthday, Abiodun Shola Thomas. So happy birthday to Yuwande Adikoya, Abiodun's husband. Yuwande is the first child of her family. She's the first of five children and she was born and bred in Lagos State. And according to Yuwande, her growing up was interesting because her parents gave her and her siblings everything they wanted. But then they didn't spoil them. They were prepared for what they were to face in the real world as adults. Yuwande met her husband, Abiodun Shalatamas, during her service year in Ibanto and they started dating before they eventually got married. She's happily married to this actor and producer, and they got married on February 14th in 2012. Their union is blessed with two lovely daughters. They have been together for over 11 years now and married for seven years on count. For you and the marriage, your motherhood is beautiful, and she thanks God for this grace. This actress doesn't really have a role model in the movie industry, but then she admires and respects some people's talents and courage. You and they admire the likes of Genevieve Naji, Omotila Jalade, Kende. Bimbo Akitona, Funka Kindele Bilu, Fetia Williams, Balugo, Bimbo Oshin, and a host of others. As mentioned earlier, Yuwande is a movie producer, an actress, and a director. Some of the movies she has featured in and produced over the years include Life Secret 1, 2006, Life Secret 2, 2007, Godudu 2009, Omo Lemon 2012, Kudi to 2013, Emiri 2014, Kuru 2015, The Sacrifice 2016, Tamara 2016, and your more 2016, or Tyler 2016, Once Upon a Time 2016, Yawa Didi 2017, Fadaka 2018, Beladona 2018, Odoin Bole 2018, Ewa Tomi 2018, Besekon 2019, Besekon 2 2019, Emi Atibabami 2019, among others. So many people say Yuande is a workaholic. Yuande stays indoors with her family. She also enjoys traveling and seeing new places. People tell her she's fun to be with. But then she's a very simple person. Even though Yuande is one of the top producers we have in this movie industry, she believes fame has not really changed who she is. Fame has only taught her to be more humble. She's also an award-winning actress and movie producer. Yuande produced the movie Omelemotion in 2012, starring the likes of Bimbo or Shin. This received five nominations 
Awards at the 10th African Movie Academy Awards. She was also nominated several times and on July 2014 and December 2014, she backed the New Actress Award and Most Promising Actress for City People Entertainment Awards, Yoruba Movie Academy Awards respectively. Iwade also won most Promising Actress 2014, YMA, and Most Promising Act 2014, Yoruba Heritage Awards, US. A film Kurukuru earned her the Best Actress Award at the 2016 ACIA ceremony. In 2017, her film Yawade Diba got the award for the Best Movie of the Year at the 2017 City People Movie Awards. This actress says that she can go to any length to interpret a role assigned to her in a movie. However, the people she works with knows her stand when it comes to nudity and featuring the scenes that are sexually explicit, so they don't send her such scripts. For her, she has always had that standard and it has nothing to do with that she's married now. She's an African woman and she's a mother. So many people ask, did Yewade ever encounter any challenge at all? Because she's really one of the hottest actresses and hottest movie producers. A while ago, Yewade's height used to be a challenge when she attends auditions. However, Yewade continuously believed in herself and remained focused. Today, she's reaping the fruits of her labor. Now what? I'm grateful to God for giving me the strength to withstand the storm as an actor. I must confess to you, it was really challenging at the beginning of my career in 2002. When I look back at the stormy moments that God helped me to conquer, my heart is always filled with thanks and appreciation. No one could have survived those troubled moments without the strength and grace that comes from God. But despite all the challenges that came away, there was never a time I felt like quitting the industry. Also about her personal life, she shared this testimony a while ago. Some years ago, all her younger siblings were married. And she was the only one left at her father's house. Iwande really wanted to get married so that she could leave her father's house. As mentioned earlier, she's the first child in the family, in a family of five. Even though she didn't feel bad that her siblings got married before, since they all graduated before. But she just wanted to leave her father's house. Well, today Iwande is happily married and she has two cute daughters. So we are also wishing you a happy birthday and may God bless your new age. You have come to the end of this episode. We hope you enjoyed it and let's know two new things. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.